So, Martin, what is new uh, about uh, next year Romanix? Yeah, next year's Red Bull Romanix is going to be uh, a great race. We're spending a lot of time out there in the mountains to come up with new trails. The Carpathian Mountains are just perfect. And we are going to spend a lot of time in the, on the tracks of the Dachian people, the people that lived here 2,000 years ago. And they left a lot of uh, trails from back in the days when they were hiking with their donkeys and, uh, and sheep. And uh, that's just perfect for enduro riding. And why is it called a vertical madness? Vertical madness because it goes up and down and not just a little bit, it's really a lot. We have over 35,000 uh, meters of vertical uh, altitude and uh, we are the only race in the world that has uh, so much up and downs and sometimes those up and downs are very long. Mm. And why do you recommend riders to register now? You have to register now because uh, otherwise uh, the starting places will be most likely taken. Um, you need your credit card available. You have to prepay 50% of the starting fee and um, then you're in. Yeah, we'll have a new class for uh, next year and I have people asking. So can you tell me more about Atom class, please? Yeah. ATEM is our new class because Iron started to get uh, too extreme and originally Iron was our class for those that come the first time, the beginners at Red Bull Romaniacs. And uh, now uh, we need to come up with a new class where you don't need to throw your bike or walk your bike, which is the ATEM class. And uh, Iron class has been a bit upgraded and uh, is getting a bit more, more extreme and more hard and durable. I have a guy from uh, Thailand who contacted me and he wanted to know if he can compete in gold class if he won uh, local races in his country. Yeah, if you win in your country local race, you will most likely not uh, be ready for gold. Gold is for the best of the best. And if you want to finish in gold, then you should have uh, some experience racing with the other top guns. And uh, you need to be kind of close to their level to finish gold. Do they need a support team during the race? Uh, it's very difficult if you arrive at night and you're tired and you need to change your own tires. So it's very helpful to have somebody helping you. But you don't necessarily need to bring your own mechanic. Uh, you can book a, a service uh, from several service providers that will wash your bike, change your tires, fix the broken parts. So then you can focus on racing only and uh, relax in the afternoon and evening. Okay, and I have also people asking if they cannot uh, ship the bikes to Romania, what options do they have? Yeah, if you're coming from uh, overseas, I would definitely rent a motorcycle here in Romania. There is uh, a lot of uh, partners that are renting motorcycles, partly brand new or only one year old, so you can rent a very good quality bike that gets you into the, into the finish and uh, also for affordable prices. Mm. Uh, people are also asking how long will be the days and how uh, how difficult it will be? Yeah, it will be difficult, of course. This is Red Bull Romaniacs. Uh, the days depends how fit you are. If you are a very fast rider, you may finish in four, five, six hours. And if you are a slow rider, you will not finish in 10 hours. Hmm. And the last question, do you recommend uh, uh, competitors to bring their families with them? Family support is always nice, especially if you come home uh, dirty and uh, worked. Uh, on the other hand, what can they do there? Only what you suffer? No, there is a lot of possibilities. They can go and see spectator points. They can enjoy sea view and uh, countryside. They can see the, the, top, the top riders passing by very close at spectator points. So we have a, a, a very large program of things that you can do while uh, watching Red Bull Romaniacs and uh, all the information they can find on the website. I think it's pretty intense what they can do. Nice. So good luck with the registration, everybody, and see you in Sibiu next year. <laughs> see you in Sibiu next year, yeah. Make sure you come and register fast.